mean different things to different people. Maybe for you it's all about lazing around on the beach with a good book, or perhaps it's exploring the natural wonders. Well, this is the historic town of Tenterfield in the New England region of New South Wales, and we're about to meet a couple after my very own heart. Mandy Reid and her husband Hamish love nothing more than grabbing their dogs and their empty van and heading out to fill it with treasures as they travel. Preferably. That's what I like to see. Hard at work. How are you? Good, thank you, Tara. Is treasure? Yes. So yes, beautiful, it is. isn't it? it this is, this is your life, isn't it, you two? You just go around gathering these treasures from all over Australia? We do. We so love beautiful. a drive. I just wanna live it up. Take the schnauzers and off we go. So we travel up to 5,000 kilometres each trip, all the way to Victoria, Tasmania. You're a patient man. No, you're the driver. You love it. Yeah. So you're the driver, you're the spotter. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Good team. Yes, great team. So once it's come back from the van, goes in here. Tables upside down, chairs stacked. Which Is there are a just certain incredible. thing that you go for? Chippy, well, chippy paint and age. To run your hands over that age is just, there's nothing like that feeling. Do you do all of the handiwork on it? I like to ensure that whatever we sell is in repair to a condition where it's at least stable. And I'm not allowed to put it into the shop unless that's done. <laughs> it's a good team. garden is just so beautiful. Just waiting to burst out. And this is the store? Yes, it is so indeed. Amazing. So yeah. did it always look like this? No, it was uh, originally when we came here 24 years ago, it was just a 6x6 zinc loom shed. So you've got this little porch on the front, so you've just taken some old stained old glass windows. windows and just built them in. See, yes. anyone could do that. I'm going to go shopping. Right, I'll see you later. <laughs> I just don't know where to look. There's just treasures everywhere. Yes. This dresser. Yes. Magnificent. It's an, an old Australian dresser. Uh -huh. Original paint. The drawer. You've got to have a drawer that works properly. They're just and glides. They're just, just magnificent, aren't they? The scale's beautiful. And now with all our old bowls that we're using these days. Aren't they great? That's Hoffman, which is a great Australian pottery. See, I've heard of the Fowlerware, but yes. not Hoffman. That's your Fowlerware there. Here's another one. There's one there, uh -huh. which oh, is pretty beautiful. Blue. So what sort of price would something like this fetch? About $60. Yeah? Yeah, Gee. absolutely. It's good, so they hold their value. And such a mm. modern, beautiful colour. Yes, that's right. And so usable, though. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you could use that for cereal, couldn't you? Well, my son would probably go for the biggest one, I would say. Yeah. Not that one. That would be my size. <laughs> that one would be his. <laughs> you just curate things so beautifully. Thank you, darling. Everything Thank makes you. me want to buy it. Good. So good. good. So good. <laughs> hat lasts? It's a hat block, they call them. OK. And they're quite... I mean, you could use it just as is or put it on a hallway table for your hat as you're Great walking idea. in and out of the house. See, I think that makes sense. You don't want anything that's a dust collector. No. You want things that are useful. I love the scale of this table. table. So this would look amazing in an apartment, wouldn't it? So you could have a modern sort of setting. That's put right. Put something like in. It would just be character plus. I even love your floors. Just a concrete floor. Yeah. And just use the stencil on them. And what on earth is that? They are European veggie mashes. Really? Yeah. So for your mashed potatoes. So, yeah. And pumpkin. And pumpkin. I honestly have and never seen anything like that before. Beautiful. And don't they look good as a group? They do, don't just they? Just a nice decorative just a object. Nice, that's right. So probably like me, once you've got these beautiful things, do you find it really hard to part with them? It is very hard to part, but it's a shop, so they do get sold. Yeah. Instagram's my biggest seller at the moment. Is that incredible? So something that's old has now gone into this modern that's world. Right. That's it. So of all the things that I want to buy in here, Figgy would have to be the most. The most. Loved. She's so cute. <laughs> How old is Fig? Fig is 10 weeks old on Friday. Watchdog, right? Watchdog, the shop dog. You're so cute, aren't you? 
So this is the flower room. I've heard it a lot is. about this space. This is where you run workshops? This is, this is where we do our workshops. Ooh. As you can see, it's got the most beautiful light. It's fantastic. Uh, we do lovely morning teas. We pick the flowers, cut the flowers, mm -hmm. and bring them in and arrange. I there think pigs off and running. Off and running. Do you want to go and explore the garden? <laughs> Should we go out and see the flowers in the garden? Yeah. Oh, she's so cute. Can I take her home? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Your garden's blossoming. Look at mm. this. What have we got growing? Well, we have sweet pea, dahlias. We also seed out foxgloves. We also grow peonies, don't we, hun? We grow yeah. peonies. Yeah. Which are coming into bud at the moment. Yeah. 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 I truly think you've both struck the most perfect balance. I mean, here you are living life in the country. It's peaceful. And yet you're travelling. You can travel all over New South Wales whenever you want even all over Australia, and you've got a thriving business to boot. We love a drive, don't we? Yeah, and there's that. Other people who enjoy what, the product we've got, then yeah. it makes us happy. Yeah, mm. so. and, and such a good part of the world that you live in too, just based out here in the country. It it's is, kind it's of, lovely. It's a little it's bit very quiet, away. isn't it? Mm. It's lovely. It's very nice. Well, it's it won't be quiet sweet. for long. <laughs> Trust me, all the people from the cities are going to be out here shopping for your vintage. Yeah. So you better get back in that van and go and find go. some more. <laughs> <laughs> I think we can be sold that. out in a week. <laughs>